Hey my friend, what's going on Kater here on a beautiful, beautiful day. I'm really excited to bring you this SEO training. Maybe you was looking in YouTube, Google, somewhere on the internet land. You ended up on my blog. This training today, it's going to be about, you know, how can you get um, your results to be showing in your blog post on Google, right? Because sometimes if you have your own personal blog or you're using any other blog, you're trying to get your blog post to show. Let's say I come here and I put and I put a search for something let's search for something like you know make money online and it, when you come to Google right you will see some people like the first one doesn't have it doesn't have a picture right this help you big time because people for some reason they just like to see a picture and it gives you more of a realness so a lot of people will go for the third one due to the fact that you have your picture that's showing here you have an icon so a lot of people wanted to know how to do that I myself started a brand new blog and I wanted to know how to do that and I said hey let me teach it to other people man I am excited man I just started this new blog and it's ranking you know so fast due to the fact I have tools and understanding a better understanding of what I'm doing to, to actually um, rank so how do you do that uh, with your regular blog there are certain things that you're gonna need if you want if you want your blog to show your picture like this is my blog I'm gonna do it live with my blog so you guys can see so this is my blog I'm ranking for this quick review of this new product that we just released called instant noise and if I clicked on it over here this is my blog so this is instant noise review but as you guys can see it's not showing my picture it's just showing so when people are looking at these they rather click on something that has a picture right because that's just how automatically your mind thinks right you go to the icon what's showing you a little bit more so if they click here they will get to my blog but there is no picture in the results on Google so I'm gonna teach you how do you do that how do you put the picture there's certain step, steps that you need to have in place well first thing what you need to do I need you to open a couple of tabs right the first tab I want you to go to Google go to Google first and then you're gonna search for webmaster tools so let's go to Google here and we're gonna search for webmaster webmaster tools right click on that link it's gonna take you to webmaster tool so when you come to webmaster tool what you need to do is to test your URL right so we're gonna go into testing our URL the site URL matter of fact don't go to web go to structured data testing tool right let's just because that's the main site so let's go to website I mean structured data testing tool right so you can just type it in Google it will come up this the site so when you come here put your URL so you can test it to see what it looks like on Google so I'm gonna test mine with my blog so my blog is cstraffickbananas.com slash blog if I preview it this is what it looks like and if you preview your own blog get your own blog URL what you need to do is open your blog whatever your your blogging platform is or whatever your blog is like mine is actually see a traffic bananas .com slash blog so I, I just opened that and it's gonna take me to my main page my main blog page right so whatever your main blog page whether you're using a company's blog just get your main URL to the blog or you're using your own WordPress blog get your main blog page and come here put it inside of the inside of this testing tool and once you preview it as you guys can see this is what it looks like on Google there's no picture now how do you fix that how do we fix that there's certain things that we're gonna need in place so what I want you to do is to go to your blog go to your main blog go to your dashboard you're gonna go to appearance right and you're gonna go to widget We're gonna to go to widget and then from there we're gonna get a text because we're going to need one open file here for the side text. So we're gonna let, let's actually put it at let's put it at the bottom. All right, since we're not really gonna use it, let's put it all the way at the bottom here. Right? Move the text and put it on the sidebar. So what's gonna go in that text button here? I want you to go to Google, your Google profile, right? So what you're gonna do is go to your Google Plus. So if you go to Google.com, you go to Google Plus, you go into your profile, you log in. If you don't have a Google profile, open one, log in inside of your Google profile, 
once you and click on the side button here that says home and you want to click on the little button on the side it's going to take you to google plus go to profile we're going to get your profile and guys this used to take me this used to take me a long time to do and now i'm showing you how to do it the easy way right people can show it to you how to do it the long way but this is the quick fast and easy way to get it done so you're going to go to about section once you're inside of the profile you go into your about section you're going to scroll down all the way at the bottom where it says links and you're going to click on edit so once you click on edit over here you're just going to add a custom link so you're going to add one link i'm going to take that out you give it the name that you want so what we're going to do is to add a link we're going to give it the name that we want so let's give it the name of my blog freedom reachers blog that's the name of my blog and then in there you want to put your blog URL so that Google can pick up and also you want to have a you want to have a picture in your profile because that's the pictures that's going to be showing on Google when people search for you right so you want to make sure that your Google profile has a picture in it blog so that's my blog and then I'm just gonna click save all right so that's gonna save it in Google so now I have my picture in Google so now the next thing that I need to have is to have that same picture in my blog in my widget section so you want to come here in your Google Plus you want to get your Google Plus because Google Plus is actually what's gonna show the results on Google with your picture on it so I want to get the link not the about part but just get to the numbers here copy this link and then we're gonna put it inside of our widget section so over here remember we had um, we haven't put it but let me just put the new one just get a text and we're gonna drag the text here put it right here and then we're gonna put the code so I'm gonna put this in YouTube or on my blog if you're watching this is a step-by-step -step, really a little PDF SEO training where you need to go Google webmaster then you go to Google profile you know get that bot pick Google profile link you get the link from your Google profile go to your blog setting appearance widget text and then this is the code that you're going to add all you need is to take out if you copy it under my my blog or on on my YouTube video just copy this whole thing and what you need to do is to take out this link and put the link of your Google profile so really easy guys just go to your Google profile get the link until the numbers copy boom and I'm gonna paste it here boom there you go my link is inside all I gotta do now is save it now I'm gonna go and test it into the Google structured data testing tool so I'm just gonna click on preview now with the same link alright so once you do that you should be able to once you click on preview bang there you go it's showing my picture and now it's showing the results with my picture so now that is powerful when someone is searching for me on Google and they will be able to see not only my icon but they see something here and it's gonna entice them more to click on my blog so definitely if you find any value in this training please like share leave a comment below let me know how you feel if you're on my blog please leave a comment so that I can rank even higher and give more value to other people that was Cater I will see you guys later bye